Welcome to Add-ons with the On King. This video is going to talk about reset card scheduling. It's kind of debatable whether this one you considered necessary or not, but I have used it multiple times and that's why I'm doing this video. Okay, the reset card scheduling is a useful one. Anki kind of has a built-in thing to help you and this just takes it a little step further. So if we go to the browser, we previously made a card in this tutorial deck you can see it's due later and we've reviewed it once it is still being learned so I'll see it tomorrow if I go to edit and reschedule this is Anki's native form so we're gonna reschedule it it's kinda nice that Anki's got this you can place in the review queue so if we wanted to see it in two to three days we could do that and boom it's gonna show us in two to three days which is nice or we can set it as a brand new card but if you look over here, you'll see it still says there was a review. And so it's not completely resetting the card. So where this add-on is extremely useful is, for example, I, if I have used Zonky for an entire semester and towards the end of the semester, I have a friend who wants to start using Zonky but doesn't know which cards I've unsuspended because we've covered them in the curriculum already, what I can do is send my Zonky deck by exporting it and giving it to them. But when I hit export, it's extremely important. I'm going to include the scheduling information. Now that may seem a little weird, but when we go into the browser, I'm going to go back to this example card. When I send it to them, it's going to say that I've already reviewed cards multiple times. So if we look at my Zonky deck here, we can see I've reviewed cards multiple times already, and so they may not want that information. So where this is really useful, go back to my example card, if you go to edit, instead of using Anki's native one, we're gonna go to the bottom here to the add-on, reset scheduling and learning. It's gonna reset it completely as a brand new card, so it's not going to factor in any of the lapses settings or intervals or how many reviews we've done, so that's why it's a useful add-on. Thanks for learning with The On King. If you enjoyed this, please give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, please leave any and all questions and comments. Here's our email. We will try to make as many of these videos as we possibly can to help you as you study.